we can't stop every raider. We can't stop the taxpayers from rebelling every time we don't swoop in and save the day. Sir? I haven't forgotten about you, clever girl. Will you take point on that intel, Jen? I'm spending all of my time in the interrogation room. Yes, sir. You, you really got to meet this girl, Jen. She's just your type. I don't make a habit of romancing the enemy, sir. Or girls. Of course. I'm joking. Either way, interrogation is a science. And I'm spending my, the rest of my time on this smear campaign for father. And on that note, did Ellie actually apologize to you? She did. Was it hilarious? I, th I bet it was hilarious. Not really. Are you planning on writing a report that says Harry and Trace and Albright conspired to assassinate Maddie Ballin? Yeah. Did Ellie tell you? Maddie was exiled from Greenden because she was hurting her people. Doesn't matter. Uh, will you, by the way, go through the video and see if you can find any other images that will further our expose? Is there anything in that bit where she came from? back that we can use to further the narrative? Sir, I have served your family loyally my whole life, but I- What's wrong, clever girl? An expose, a public humiliation, and a peaceful transfer of power. I thought you'd be all about that these days. They won't have a choice. There will be riots. Ha! Huh. We can only hope. I'm writing up the report now, and it'll be released the day, the day after tomorrow, and should- God willing, be in Greenden territory 48 hours from now with fast riders. I'm glad to hear it, sir. Never mind. Don't look on the videos. Jen, you'll do that as well. Yes, sir. You need some time away from them. Look through the files for that transcript on the leader of the eyes. Would that be all right? I know they're your pet project. Of course. Why are you doing that? I'm not t telling the general what you d didn't say just now, because you're my friend and I like you. And let's be honest, it's good to know something a bit tre tre treacherous about your friends. It allows me to trust you and c keeps me in good c company. But safety rests with family, and I'd hate for you to lose this one. I understand. Thank you, sir. Find me that transcript. I will. Until the end. Hey, are you alright? I will not let the Berkey family ruin somebody else's life. going to go find her. Listen, unless Charlie shows some major improvement. Anna said that the drugs would wear off by this afternoon. Uh, radioactive! Radioactive! Uh. You can't find Kimber with a drugged out Charlie imagining dragons the whole time. Your sister. Kimber? Where did she go? She just up and left when... She wouldn't have left you. A sister couldn't just... That's exactly what she did. She removed herself from the equation. Adrian, I know it seems like... She blames herself that people got hurt. That you... It's not. I wanted her to. Okay? I mean, I'm glad that everyone's safe and everything, but if the alternative is her losing her medication, then it's not her fault. We're going to go tell her that. 
Uh, She'd go to Varnes. Hey, Trace. Do not! No! Callie! It's too late! His assistant already destroyed them! And no them. one stopped her? No one was watching them? We thought somebody had eyes on the pills! No one did! Did she get all of them? Yes. Are you good? Should I let go? What happened? Heidi James took the pills we found in the FRB supplies before she was arrested. She dissolved them in boiling water, and she dumped them out the window of the convoy. It's murder! You know that this cannot change our sentencing. We have to exile them if we kill either of them. She's a murderer! Trace! Trace! How's Dr. Ramirez? She came by earlier to see if anything could be saved. And? I lost my sprout samples in there. Your sprout samples were dead, Harry. I know, but I wanted to compost them. Charlie's awake. Yeah? How was he? He was really out of it. Trace, Anna wants to see you. Uh, shit, I've got Trace, to- Trace, just, just breathe. It'll be okay. Yeah. You know, it used to be like that thing was attached to her arm. She just needs time. Yeah, maybe. But talking with you, I, I think she might need more than that. Amazing what candor can do. This is it, isn't it? Us. I understand. I'm glad the lab burned down, because when we were talking before, I was about to agree. But when the lab caught fire, I realized I wanted to fix it with you. Every time things come crashing down, we just, we just come back together, but... That was even like when we first started dating. We only got together because it was the end of the world and we made it suck a little less. Yeah, hard to see it reduced to so little, right? It's awful though, Dane. I... I can't just... You just want everyone to be safe and happy. I never realized that that could be a flaw. Yeah, well... I was just trying to avoid this. I'm not breaking up with you. Why? You said we only got together because the world was in disarray. Is that why you stayed for three years? No. I love you, Dame. We don't work well together. But I want to try fixing it. I, I want to try being better. I'm glad. So we'll fix it. Mm. That's off, right? Nope. Oh, God damn it. Charlie cannot be in a car for the amount of time that it would take to get to Varnes. Not with his arm like that. He and Kimber are close. Is there any way? Not unless you're willing to risk further damage. Can we please stop talking about me like I'm dying? Kimber actually might be, and I don't appreciate it. How are you, Charlie? I'm 20 years old, is how I am. What kind of nerve damage are we talking about? Anything ranging from major scarring to further loss of mobility. 
We already knew that was a risk though, right? I mean, just call me Charlie Skywalker. We'll find her. We'll bring her back here and you'll see her soon. Screw that, I'm coming with you. Do I need to pull rank on you? Listen. Kimber disappeared. And she thinks she killed her brother. Also, I have just found out that she is without the medicine that keeps her alive. Charlie, Kimber or no Kimber, I am telling you that you cannot go with them. You are too sick. Get Team Apocalypse back together is a go. A little worse for the wear.